So what I like to do with out of the box cylinder heads, um, never install them. Well, I never install them out the box. What I like to do is clean them up. I'll take a little car cleaner and then I'll lubricate everything with the um, assembly uh, spray. Now, some people buy heads and they slap them on with no issues. But seeing that this is a offshore casted cylinder head, even though ARP assembled the valve, the valve train, I'm just gonna go through everything and I'm gonna blow out the uh, water jackets. Um, I probably won't chase the, uh, the boats. I'll, I'll think about that, I might, but you know, just um, taking out the valves, cleaning up the seats, you know, just taking a look at the seats, inspecting them, making sure there's nothing um, obviously wrong with them. Then I'll put some fluid down in there and see if it leaks and just make sure there's no problems with the head before I put it on the car. So what I do is I'll take the air gun, blow out, the ports, um, the water jackets, you know, I even get up here in the threads, spark plug hole. Um, also, maybe blow a little air down to the valve guys. Just, you know, I want to eliminate the possibility of any contaminants getting in here and ruining the, um, the valve train. So we'll um, get started on this. And maybe I might do a time lapse, I'm not sure. In a nutshell, that's what I like to do when um, I purchase out-of-the-box heads. A last, um, gosh, brand new set of heads I had were some um, World Product Windsor Seniors. Not even sure if you can, can get those anymore. But um, the GC40 X heads, when I bought those used, I took those straight to a machine shop. There's no point in me trying to disassemble it and inspect it because at that point, I personally believe that anytime you buy, especially cylinder heads you use, you have to have them inspected. 
doesn't matter what the person tells you. It doesn't matter, um, you know, what kind of documentation they give you. Just have the stuff checked professionally to give yourself a peace of mind because um, you just never know. Like even with these um, GT40X heads I'm gonna sell, you know, if somebody bought them, I would tell them, you know, make sure you have them inspected. Don't take what I say about them as, you know, gospel. Figure it out from a, prof uh, from a professional. So um, yeah, th these heads, um, I'm gonna try to put them on as soon as possible. I pour a little alcohol down in the chambers or in the ports just to make sure I didn't have any leaky valves. Everything was nice and tight. Um, nothing looked suspicious or out of the ordinary. So we're gonna get ready to throw these bad boys on and uh, see what happens. So leave a comment if you um, have ran heads right out the box with no problems and leave a comment about that. Or if you disassemble your heads out of the box, let me know. I uh, really appreciate the support I'm getting from everybody. Tell a couple of friends about the channel. I appreciate your time and God bless.